What's up guys? I want to give you today one tip to make your punch faster. Guaranteed, this is gonna make your punch faster. Now, I hope you guys can bear with me because my upload overnight didn't make it. For some reason it died out. So the video I had planned for today is uploading for tomorrow or maybe the next day. We'll see how that goes. I'm just filming on the iPhone. The sound quality is not great. Many people have brought to my attention that when I use the, the, the phone, the sound quality is not great. And I'm trying to get something to make that better. But again, for now, bear with me. Now let's talk about speed. Can't guarantee my speed's gonna look very fast because I just finished a crazy hard upper body workout and I'm feeling sluggish. But I can take you through this, no problem. When we see people trying to punch, many people, most people I talk to go, man, I wish I could punch faster. I just can't get that speed I want. And most people focus on extending their hand out, whatever the punch is. Get it there really fast. Get it there really fast. So I say, bam. Bam. And that's the main focus of the punch. But the tip for today to increase your punching speed is to focus more on your re-chamber than the extension. Now, obviously the extension is the part that's super important in terms of inflicting damage. But when we're thinking about the overall speed of the punch, this is only half of it. So if I come out at 100%, but then I draw back at more like 80% because I go, oh, I'm going to kind of break or I don't really need to worry about it as much. That is where the overall punching speed fails. So what I want you guys to do right now, even if you're ready and you can stand up and just try throwing out, think basically the hand is going to start right at the cheek, whatever the punch is, it's going to start right there. You're going to extend out 100% as fast as you can, still get the full rotation through the body, still maximize the proper movement. And then from there, think right back to your cheek as fast as you can. When you deliver 100%, 100%, you now have your full speed punch. Now, of course, there are ways to increase your speed. You can look around the YouTube channel and find tips. I've delivered full videos before on things you can do, drills you can do. But for today, just stand there and just go out, back, pop, pop, pop. And I'm focusing on the extension. But as soon as I get to here, then I'm going drop back. And sometimes I'll use resistant ba resistance bands. Sometimes I'll grab a band, I'll hold out here and I'll just go pull back as fast as I can. Then I'll go slowly out and then pop. And we're doing the same thing. Just tap, tap, tap. Make sure the other hand stays high. Again, focus on the technique because the technique ultimately is more important than the speed. You can be the fastest guy in the world, but if you have terrible technique, the power will suffer and you will get countered. I would suggest if I was going to say how many times a week you should utilize this drill until you really get it ingrained or even once it's ingrained, still working that idea, that concept, I would say start off and give me three times a week. You can do three times a week where you sit down and you take five minutes and you just sit there and you go through every punch, maybe you know, 45 seconds on the jab, a little movement in between, boom, boom. And then you work your cross and then you move on something to maybe your uppercut. Again, same thing. You deliver, you drag it back. Think of the fastest route back. Don't go, I threw it like this. So I'm going to pull it back like that. Here, back. Same with the hook. Here, back right away. Fastest route back is going to be the quickest, obviously, which will then increase the overall speed of your punch. Guys, I hope you enjoyed this fast, brief video. I hope the audio was not too terrible and you stuck around to the end. If you made it to here and you enjoyed the video, please give it a like. If you haven't already, join the channel, get subscribed. As always, guys, train hard. I'll see you back here soon for another video.